Y'all niggas need the up. Uh, it's your mind's right, man. I'm seeing a lot of, a lot of sour looks out there, man. I don't understand this shit. What's happening? Huh? The fuck is going on out here, man? I thought, I thought y'all would appreciate what I brought to the game. I guess I was wrong, man. It's a sad state of affairs. What's up, man? What we got over here? Yeah, yeah! What the fuck? What the fuck you want, nigga? Yeah, yeah, man. What the hell you doing over here gigging in the garbage, man? Yo, what, what you mean when I'm... Well, I'm basically looking for cans, you know oh, what I'm saying? Shit. Grass, people throw them out. Oh, you know word? what I'm saying? And I just find them, you know what I mean? Damn, well, man, what's you, good? What you, you doing? You came off, man. You, damn, you got a lot of cans in there, homie. Yeah, man, that's what I do, man. You know what I'm saying? I can't afford paint like that, so... I don't like stealing, so you know what I'm saying? Like, gotta, you know, do what I gotta do to get my paint if I wanna get up there, you know what I mean? Uh, what yeah. you doing with a camera, though? Why you asking all these questions? You the fucking police? Nah, nah, I'm not the police, but I'm documenting the artwork that's on these walls right now. Oh, where? Yeah, yeah. Oh, on that note, why you wanna ask some questions or something? Yeah, yeah, homie, what Yo, is hold it? up, on that note, let me take off. Yo, can I sit down then? Yeah, sit down. Right here's good? Right here's perfect. You know, I had to take off the mask, you know what I'm saying? I nice. Smile is good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. good. You got a million dollar smile, homie. Oh, oh shit. shit. You made me blush. Look, look. <laughs> Fucking cheeks turning green. All right. What is it that you write? Y-A-O. Right. Awesome, obviously. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> you yeah. You already know. And what crew is it that you write? Basically, uh, main crew that I rock, TDO. TDO and... Uh, TWA was one of my first, you know, crew. But right now, I just bring, you know, basically my main crew is TDO. All right. And uh, what does TDO stand for? Those damn outlaws, and um, they got a lot of different, the defiant ones, and so many different acronyms, I guess, if that's what you want to call them. Got you. You know what I'm saying? The dumb outs, you know, ready for everything that was good. All right. And who's, who's some of the members of TDO? Well, TDO, we got my man Doc. Joe's artist, uh, Urkel, uh, fucking Aver, you got Reflex, I mean, there's so many to fucking name, man, you know, fucking Zavo, you got, so it's, it's a lot of fucking dudes, it's a lot of dudes, TVOs, right. man. So we out here in Connecticut, but where are you originally from? I'm originally from East New York, Brooklyn. New lots in New Jersey. Right. Just in case, you know what I'm saying? New yeah. lots in New Jersey. Test my gangster. No, nah, I'm joking. Don't test my gangsta. I ain't no G. I just, you know what I'm saying? Positive vibes. But yeah, man, you know, I grew up in East New York. I went PS13, Pennsylvania Avenue. For those of you um, that know Pennsylvania have, I went to fucking IS-292. Not that y'all give a fuck. Um, and I also, um, I did, I did a, a fucking high school fucking tour. I only did two tours. I went fucking Thomas Jefferson High School, you know, back when they had the uniforms and shit. I don't know if you remember those days. And um, then from there, I went to John Adams and Rockaway. So, gotcha. you know. What was it about Graf that made you want to start writing? I guess it was just an escape. To be honest, it was an escape from, from reality. It's almost like you feel like a fucking superhero, especially when you're by yourself doing things. You just feel like a, a superhero, you know what I mean? You become Casper to the world. Gotcha. It's like you feel like nobody could, nobody could see you, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and the adrenaline, it's just, it's a fucking high, you know what I mean? It's just a, such a, such a great high, and I, it's something I, that I love since I was, I mean, since I was, good 10 years old I picked up 12 years old that's when I started hitting the streets just gotcha. you know that you know we all start I don't know yeah you know y'all want to say I started with a fucking marker that's how I started just tagging shit over markets and scratches back in the early 90s you know what I'm saying I started in 92 you know you know gotcha. that shit was fun what's the, what's the ultimate goal with graph for you well right now my goal to keep it a buck, man, is to grow from the street graph. Like, I ain't really fucking with the street graph no more. I'm trying to stay away from jail over graph, you know what I'm saying? I've been through some stuff that don't want to really talk about that, but it just showed me, like, 
out of all the shit that I did to go to jail for, for grab, I'm like, huh. Then I just woke up and one day I was like, you know what, I'm gonna try to, I ain't gonna front, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to make money out of this. And the reason behind that is, why not make money out of something you love? You know what I'm saying? I fucking love graph, I, I'm not biased, I love all types of writers, you know what I'm saying, I, 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 I'm not, I love all, I love, they, they people in all different crews and all of that, as long as they respect me and I respect them, like I fucks with you, you fucks with me, I fucks with you, it's real, it's real easy, simple mathematics, it's logic, it's one plus one equals three, ah, went over your head, nah, but anyhow, you feel me, like it's just simple logic, you know what I'm saying, cause that one person you beefing with, is that one person that you could make in, uh, you could be making a million dollars with, you understand? So you're not gonna talk over a crew without knowing each other. So it all depends on how in depth the beef is, you understand? So you gotta look at it from a brighter perspective. Hope I ain't talking your ears off, but I'm just speaking facts, you know what I'm saying? Too, too much, too, too much times our pride get us in our way from making money. They, they, you know, the pride gets in front of the way from, you know, collabing with, with real situations where you can make real situation money. You know what I mean? Now, you got you got uh, canvases for sale? Yeah, I'll be trying to sell canvases, you know, on... on, on uh, I'm a, well, basically, I, I just started, because I, I was doing canvases for a collection, but now I'm going to start doing a series of canvases of cartoons and, and the tag name somewhere around this so I could just you know try to sell that shit man not for nothing I saw somebody selling my shit on Etsy and I was like wait a minute some nigga making money or just a picture of something that I did hold up I must be doing something wrong you know what I'm saying because I ain't getting no bread so I figured that I'm gonna just give it a try it don't hurt to to, to, to move on that path and stay true to yourself because I don't claim nothing I don't claim the streets, I don't claim to be a street bomber, a legend, this and that, this something that I fucking love. And I'll bleed for it. Gotcha. Now, you got any shout outs you want to give before we get out of here? Yeah, I just want to give, you know, definitely I want to give you a shout out, you know what I'm saying? The man behind the camera. I want to give fucking Vin, BMF, Dag, fucking Urko, supposed to be here. I don't know what happened. Um, you know, just everybody from the neighborhood, you know what I'm saying? Everybody from the hood now, since now I'm repping, you know, I guess CT, but somewhere in here it says I'm so Brooklyn, not that it matters, but I'm so fucking Brooklyn dead ass, word up. You know what I'm saying? If the, if the Tims don't say so, then I don't know what else to tell you. Oh, wait, 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 wait. And, and, and uh, you know, but never mind that. That's just, you know what I'm saying? It's a Brooklyn thing, you know what I'm saying? Maybe Is that a Brooklyn thing or a Puerto Rican thing? I don't know if it's a Puerto Rican thing, but I know you know. I know, can't say much. They, they, this to help me in case I get into a car accident, the yeah. fucking seatbelt. You gotta cut the seatbelt out, you know what I mean? It's, Just in case you got a delivery, you gotta open some boxes. Boxes, you know what I'm saying? It's a utility tool. Nah. All right, man. Yo, it was good meeting you. Definitely good meeting you. You wasting your time being a nobody Shout out to you being the killer, killing nobody Shorty told you she a model, she a nobody They ask me who I'm in here with, I tell them nobody He a boss in your hood, but he a nobody She got a shape, she look good, but she a nobody That's a nice act, but you ain't fooling nobody They ask me who I answer to, I tell them nobody Uh, fly shit, that's my kind of talk, yeah one on one, that's my kind of cloth. Nah, we not alike, boy, you kind of soft. They said on the pan of Queens, nigga had the flies walk. You out here living off your brother and your cousin. All right, man, uh, let everybody know what it is that you write. I write DAG HOF. All right, and how long have you been writing for? About 15 years on and off. Okay. What was it about Graph that got your interest? The first time I seen a Redbird pull into the station, it was a top to bottom, man, and pretty much. My family was against it, but I liked it. I thought it was dope. And uh, you're from, you said you were from Brooklyn, right? Correct. I'm from Brooklyn, New York. Uh, what, what, what are some, who are some of the writers from Brooklyn that inspired you? Uh, definitely DG. Um, who else? Uh, I mean, DG was the, mo the main inspiration, but uh, you also got people like Zekt, 3-6 and uh, Acid, GNS, 
my boy Dust TCM, um, a lot of old heads from I want to say like the 80s to the 90s definitely inspired me, especially the 2000s. Gotcha. I see that you do uh, you, you do bombing and you do piecing. Which one is it that you prefer? I prefer bombing. Uh, definitely love doing streets, and uh, I'm, I really like tunnels. I really like to, uh, to search the tunnels. Not even, you know, to do graphs. Sometimes you just search the tunnels just to see how far them shits go down. Now, uh, what, what should we expect from DAG in the future? Uh, definitely more. Um, like I said, you know, it's on and off, but it's just about trying to stay consistent and keep doing your thing, you know? Definitely, definitely travel more. Uh, already hit a couple states, but uh, trying to go out of state now. Probably Japan, Tokyo, and shit like that. Gotcha. You want to give any shout outs to anybody? Yeah, shout out to the whole HOF family. My boy Blah. Yo, Blah. yo, that's that dude, Dag, son. HOF, bitch ass niggas. Like I was saying. <laughs> Shout outs to my boy Blah, Crash, um, Topaz, Jevil, uh, the whole HOF family, you know what I'm saying? Uh, east to West. And of course, you know, my peoples out here, BMF, Vin, fucking Yao, Neves, uh, Herkel, uh, you know, uh, Veska, all, all those peoples out there, you know? All right, peace. Definitely. Destiny, but dealing with adversity tends to bring out the best in me. Although I'm favored heavily, devils pursue aggressively. And never for a second do I ever say just let me be. Instead, I use the energy to stoke a fire already burning. Yeah, man, what you write? I write Van Wolf, BMF. Alright, and um, when did you start writing? Man, I've been writing since 91. 91, yeah. So where where you originally from? I'm originally from, from the Bronx. From the Bronx? Sure. Yeah, and where we at right now? Right now we in Hartford in the skate park, just doing a little fun, little fun activity, just getting our shit out there just for the hell of you know. Dude. I see, I see you did a stomper. Yeah, man, I, I just can't go small, man. Yeah, man, probably motherfucking feelings, man. That's what we do. That, yo, it's either go big or go home, cause that's all we do. Big or go home. Yeah, who who some of the members of BMF? Uh, you got Mame, you got Two, you got OV. You got Case, uh, who else? You got a lot of members that they all spread out. You know, you got niggas from, from like you say, Earn. You got a lot of niggas like, like Jekyll, Kane, you know, Coast. So many to keep naming. I got too many. All right. And uh, so we were at, where we at again? Right now we're in Hartford Skate Park. Hartford Skate Park. And it's just, it's just a free fall in here? Anybody could paint? Yeah, anybody could paint. As long as you can find a spot, you can go over somebody if you want to or if you're there. But the best thing is to find a good spot, rock, and let it last as much as possible. Got you. And uh, you, you got any uh, any riders that you roll with around out here? Yeah, I got my little crew, you know what I mean? It's a, we got, you, guys, you can say it's a collabo crew, because you got BMF heads mixed with HOF heads, mixed with BE, you know what I mean? So at the end of the day, I roll, I roll my boy Yao, you know, Yao be always in the building. Fucking Dag, and my man Urkel, you know, uh, who else? I got my boy, my boy, uh, Poet. We got, uh, who else? We got Neves. You know what I mean? Sometimes my boy Zerk come up from, from Florida. You know, we be out here. All right, no doubt. You want to give any shout outs? Nah, I just want to give a shout out to, to my man Crip. You know what I mean? I, I, I know he ain't here right now at the moment to be in front of the camera. But at the end of the day, that's my nigga. I love that nigga to death. Shout outs to all my niggas. You know, Yao, Neves, everybody from the crew. Dag, everybody. That's how I roll. All my niggas in New York, BTC, BMF, you know, a, uh, SM, YP, all them niggas, you know how we roll, man. We stay deep, nigga. Kingsbridge all day, nigga. 
That's how we do. Then one PMF, peace out, man. Now, can you hear me? One, two, one, two, one, two. Turn my levels up. Can you hear me? Diz the icon. Volume two. Make them suffer. Of course, it's yours truly, DJ, whatever. Of course, I'm back. Just because I'm on that radio, that Power 105, just because I'm touring the globe and all that, don't mean I'm not back with my brother. Diz the icon. Make them suffer. Volume two. You know what time it is, Diz. I'm not even going to do too much talking right now, all right? Let's get right Make into it, baby. Suffer. DJ, whatever, Diz, the Value icon. Let's two. go. Nickel. Yo, live. What up, man? Ball talk music. What up, man? Hold up. That BRCMG shit, nigga. Y'all out entertainment. It's motherfucking work. Vengeance is mine, say if the Lord. But the pain that I've endured that's very deep in my core makes it easy to ignore what the Lord say. I promise you I'll slay you if you play me, cause I ain't the one to play with. Told y'all niggas before, I don't hope I design brace them. Look grudge up in the dictionary, bet that's where my face is. Give y'all niggas a facelift, a surgical procedure. I rip your features apart without the use of anesthesia. Then lock you in the freezer to deal with you at my leisure. If ask your whereabouts, develop convenience. And amnesia. I tell them I ain't seen you and never heard of you either. Then go and find a nice secluded spot where I could leave you.